What property did Justin leave in the house, Kelly? Airsoft guns. A what? Airsoft guns. Airsoft guns? Yes, Judge. Is that sort of like, I don't know, grown-up frisbees? <laughs> uh, grown-up BB guns? What are you talking about? What is this? <laughs> An airsoft gun is a military replica. It looks and functions exactly the same as a real gun, but it fires six mil BBs. Are these the weapons that you have in your house? Uh, no, those are the weapons that were left in Kelly's property. But you're allowed to have them in the house? As, yes, you are. You're allowed to keep them on your own property. You, you have to have a special licence to buy them. Did you obtain the special licence? Yes, I did. Now, these guns are certainly worth a lot of money, right? Did you know that, Kelly? I, to be honest, I didn't know how much any of them cost him. This weaponry was left in the house. Now, you certainly didn't know the value of it, but what you did know it had some value. Yes, and what you did know is that there was an outstanding debt, correct? So what did you do, Kelly? Uh, my brother-in-law um, sold a couple of items which equivalented to £250. Well, that's, in fact, what they were sold for. Did you give permission for this stuff to be sold? Uh, I actually spoke to Kelly's father about it and he asked me if he could have permission for them to sell the guns against the outstanding debt, of which I said yes. However, I said before you sell them, just let me know what you're selling them for, obviously because of the value of the items. Did you have that discussion with Kelly? No. Very helpful. So it was your dad who actually had the discussion with Justin, right? Yes. They were sold for £250. Did you have anything to do with that sale? No. How much do you say they were actually worth? Um, I believe that they are worth at least... Just pause for saying, what do you believe again? I believe that they're worth at least half of the amount shown on the screen of each item. What, what's the total, do you say? I'd say roughly about, including all the other gear, about £1,000. Do you still have feelings for Kelly? No. Is that because she sold your gun? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. No, it's just it's been a long time and everybody's moved on. Have you? Absolutely. Now, you have an outstanding debt. It seems to me that you stopped paying the instant, frankly, she ended up in a new relationship. That's what happened. You say you were delinquent for a short period of time, but in fact it was in excess of six months for some considerable time. Now, your other point in reply, in addition to the things I should take into consideration, is that you've got no money, right? Mm-hmm. I can't understand Neolithic yes, Grant. What did you say? Yes, Judge. At the time of trying to pay Kelly back, I didn't have any money at all. Right. And your financial situation is the same now, in effect. Yes. That true, Kelly? No, Judge, it's not. Really? How do you know, Kelly? <laughs> uh, a friend of mine who is friends with Justin on Facebook kindly sent me a who photo. Who knew that Facebook was going to be such a marvellous yes. tool for judges? She she kindly sent me a photo of Justin's new car. Let's have a look. Can you go get it for me, Michelle? That looks like a nice, shiny new car, Justin. It is. Are you proud of that car? Absolutely. You put guns in the boot? <laughs> Not yet. Uh, in the comments of that photo, it states Justin says that he's got 2K. Where are the comments? Can I see the comments? Oh, thank you. No. It may be, and I'm not saying anything about your character, not saying anything about a man that enjoys time with large weapons, that he might be somebody who goes around boasting. Mm -hmm. So it could just be boasting, but let's have a look. Ah, I, I mean, I don't understand this speak, but there's somebody whose name I shan't give. There's not much more. Pick one up for five to eight K, to be honest. And it says, I only got two K. Yeah. What do you mean you only got two? It wasn't the, the money wasn't personally mine. I see. Anything you'd like to add, Justin? No, not at all. Kelly? Uh, going back to the airsoft equipment, mm -hmm. um, only some guns weren't sold. I still have uh, airsoft equipment at my house, and it's also between a friend's house, because when Justin left my family home, he lived with a friend, so they're in between my house. Um, so I don't actually have all of it in my house, it's in between. Do you know where it is? In my own house, yes, which I've, we've what asked about the friend? Him. His friend's house is in his shed. Good Lord. And we've asked him on multiple occasions to come and collect his belongings, Justin, which he's going to do. Thank you. Are you going to go and collect this stuff? 
No, I'm not going to go around the family home, no. Could you deliver it to a third party that you would agree to? We would have to find a third party. Well, there must be somebody you both know. Someone we both know, but not particularly like him, yes. Well, and well... vice versa. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure of it. Do you agree that in the next 28 days, do you undertake to go and collect that weaponry and keep it yourself? Yes, Judge. You'll have to make some sort of sensible arrangement. You need to see each other for two minutes to go and collect this stuff. Right? Yes, You can be Judge. civil enough to stand in court. You can be civil enough to sort that out. You agree that that'll be handed over, yes? Yes. Anything else? No, Judge. Anything you'd like to tell me you believe? <laughs> no. For more Judge Rinder cases, click here. And if you've got a legal issue yourself, get in touch with us by clicking over here.